Hello everyone, I'm your sports editor Matt Hamilton. And I'm your news editor Cody Boatler. And we, well, we, we took part in the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge. Now, uh, we obviously are dry now, so you can tell that this was at a, at a prior time, but we brought these shirts as evidence that we did indeed take the Ice Bucket Challenge. Mine even says challenge accepted, so how could you not, you know, listen to us on this one? Yeah, but, it happened. Yeah, we, we took it. We'll, we'll have some film on here. Um, unfortunately, the, the video was lost, but we do have a little bit of video of us being dumped by ice. But, um, yeah, Cody, you you had a couple messages you wanted to say earlier yeah. in the video. Um, so earlier I tried to say, you know, at first I wasn't huge on the whole ice bucket challenge thing because I thought the idea of having to do something so gimmicky to get people interested in charity was kind of lame, but then I realized, you know, people are still giving money, and that's pretty great. Um, that being said, however, I am not donating to the ALS Foundation exclusively. I'm also going to include other charities that I feel very strongly about, including... Appalachia Service Project, which I worked for over the summer. Um, and I encourage everyone who's watching this video to donate, not just to the ALS Foundation, but any charities that they feel really strongly about. And even more than that, you know, volunteer or get involved or just learn more about it. Yeah, and, um, and this challenge is a great way to do that. Mm -hmm. uh, for ALS, I think yesterday they raised up to $15 million at that point. So so you can tell this Ice Bucket Challenge is good. Mm -hmm. if, if whether you're donating to ALS or something else, you're you're doing something good, mm -hmm. and that's what we we try to do with this challenge mm -hmm. that you will see in a little bit, hopefully. Yeah. Um, that being said, I would like to nominate uh, three people: uh, one, Tammy Middleton, because I know it'll piss her off, um, and then two and three, my roommates Megan Graves and Lucian Joy. And I am nominating my two best friends, Bryce Yaps and Nathan Valentine, who I don't know will actually do it, but I'm nominating you anyway. Then I'm nominating my mother, Heather Hamilton, because she's a sweetheart, and Towson's own Terrence West, and and, and uh, us on, together. Uh, on behalf of the yeah, Tower Lane. On behalf of the whole Tower Lane. We would like to nominate CNN's Brian Stelter, oh. who, <laughs> who was once editor at the Tower Lane. And you have 24 hours. <laughs>